love that dirty water. I love that dirty water TV. I love that dirty water. I love that dirty water TV. Dirty water. I love that dirty water TV. The Sand Dollar is an authentic Cape Cod Beach Bar and Grill, which offers a seasonal menu featuring fresh native seafood, chowder, salads, burgers, chicken, and a variety of amazing apps to enjoy with one of their refreshing cocktails. Families check out the famous Kids Karaoke Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays check out the famous 99 cent happy hour, which includes a 99 cent raw bar. Best Oysters in the Cape, sponsored by East Dennis Oyster Farm. We got live music starting at five o'clock. The Sand Dollar is open daily from 11.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. Come in and meet the most friendly staff on Cape Cod. I got jello shots and blue shots. Hey everyone, welcome to Dirty Water TV. I'm Jennifer Manley. Hi, I'm Christian Fourier. And tonight, we're in Dennisport. We're on a summer tour and we are at the Sand Dollar Bar and Grill. Jen, let me tell you, this is my type of bar. Talk about a beach bar, right? Beach bar, I got my flip flops on. I mean, we got the surfboards hanging from the rafters, all the cool pictures. They actually have sand dollars. Everybody comes in, they actually, they find a sand dollar, yeah. put a little picture on it, they might draw draw something on it, sign their name, they stick it up on the wall. It's awesome in here. I mean, but this is total beach bar. We got some music that's getting ready to play. Yeah. And it's just unbelievable. I love the vibe here. You walk in, it's like, I'm on Cape Cod. Yeah, it, it, it's like, you know, I'm from LA, you know, you know I do the whole beach thing all yeah. the time. So to find a bar like this in, in Massachusetts really, you know, brings me some, makes me feel like I'm back at home, you know, <laughs> and it just it make, brings a tear, just one tear just right one down tear my eye. To the eye. Yeah, just one. But to wrap up just Dennis all together, we just came over from the White House Inn, had a cocktail over there. We're actually staying there tonight. It's going to be great. And talk about right on the water. Lots of places yeah. say, oh, we're right on the water, ocean view. I mean, this is literally right on the water. Yeah, and if you have family or, you know, you come with a, a, lot, a lot of kids, like I have, they have a tennis court, they have a pool, shuffleboard. they have a shuffleboard. <laughs> I mean, they, and you really are right on the beach, and, it, and they have a swing set, everything. So it's really catered to family. But you know, also, you talked about the kids, but we have, uh, let's see, aqua, aqua sport. sport kayak and jet ski rentals yeah they, they, you know this is another thing for the families because you go out there they have that big jumpaline thing they have that floats on the water yep. they got the jet skis they got a little dock you just walk down there and you can you know jet ski you want a kayak you do anything you want it's right at your beck and call you don't have to go anywhere it's all everything's right there for you all right well enough let's about do the show for let's, do the let's show. get right into the show <laughs> So from, you know, Relax Cape Cod, we're going right to the Swanky Liberty Hotel, one of our okay. favorite spots. Yes. Now, there's this group of, uh, you know, mid-20, 30-somethings in Boston that started to do some fundraising for the Haiti Relief Effort. Yep. And now they just keep it going. They go every once in a while to the Liberty. They pay, you know, 10, 20 bucks. So it's local fundraising. You go have some drinks, cocktails at a great place, and you're raising money for a great cause. How cool is that? Well, it's great because they're using the, they're using the charity as an excuse to go to have a good time, which is, <laughs> which is great. You know, but if you're if you're if you're gonna go out anyways, and you can you know bring some other friends with you and listen, everybody, this this what's going on. There's a cause that we're all kind of passionate yeah. about. Let's do it this way. I think this is a great way to go out and to give back at the same exactly. time. Exactly. So invite us. We like charity yes. and we like and we like going out. So let's check it out from Ashley. But Ashley, don't forget, next time invite us. Hey, you guys. Now, we've already seen quite a few great summer days this season, and tonight the weather could not be more perfect because we are heading inside Alibi's outdoor patio. And not to tell you all about how great Alibi is, but to drink for a good cause. Hi. Cheers, Boston. Tonight we are raising our glasses for a great cause. 
here on Alibi Chic Cozy Outdoor Patio. Guests donated just $10 to enjoy fresh summer cocktails, past appetizers, and great company, with all proceeds benefiting a Massachusetts organization called Comfort Zone Camp. It's the nation's largest bereavement camp for children between the ages of 7 and 17 who have lost a parent, a sibling, or a primary caregiver. So the, the, there are three-day weekend camps that we run. The biggest sort of objective that we have is to, to make children not feel as though they're alone in this journey. Comfort Zone Camp operates in four states, Virginia, California, New Jersey, and here in Massachusetts, located on beautiful Cape Cod in Sandwich. All campers camp for free, which makes events like this and funding from corporations vital to their success. I thought it would be a great thing to come to, to contribute giving back seem like a very good um, organization. To me, it's pretty rewarding seeing everybody have a great time, meet new people, and and if a couple bucks are raised for charity, it's, it's just all, all that better. The idea was to try to like help a good cause um, while we were out doing, uh, having fun, which we always do. Hey, that is a fantastic idea. I'm going to high-five you for that one. The founder of our organization, for some, for, since the very beginning when she founded Comfort Zone back in 1998 decided she wanted it to be a free program because death really doesn't discriminate. You know, it happens to everybody. She wanted every child and family to have the same opportunity. You're in this amazing, they call it the campable, and you're in this amazing atmosphere where the staff and the kids have just such goodness of their hearts and they're just, everyone wants to be there to help each other. and. It's kind of a rare thing to find nowadays. You guys, tonight has truly been a really fantastic experience. And as mentioned earlier, the next camp is going to be August 27th through 29th in Cape Cod in Sandwich. If you would like to volunteer as a big buddy or if you know a child who could benefit by attending the camp, please visit the website below. For Dirty Water TV, I'm Masha Daly. All right, we're having a ton of fun at the Sandal, but we have a lot more summer tour coming up. So don't forget, check our website, www.dirtywatertv.com, to find out where we're going to be and come hang out with us. I mean, we're fun. Yeah, and we're going to come back. We're back. We're going to hang out with Mark Berry at the world famous Sand Dollar Bar and Grill. And Sarah Giso is coming up for yoga and cocktails. I don't see how it goes together, but it's kind of like Jen and Christian. I don't see I how it goes together. I guess you just kind of get used to it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well that's all when Dirty Water TV returns. My name is Mark Barry. I'm on the owner of the Sand Dollar Bar and Grill, and I love my Dirty Water TV. Hey, it's Dino from Dino Sports Bar and Mash. We're here on the Cape. They know me as the Big D and I just love that Dirty Water TV. Pat Bonsai here, owner of the Beach House Restaurant, North Falmouth, Cape Cod, and I love that Dirty Water TV.